Now, Jackson said that he was the one who had the majority of fights with Dom throughout the show and that they fought at every single dinner party. It wasn't really between Olivia and Dom. Is that true? No. I've I heard think him that, say that a few times, no, but I've never really heard it from anyone else. No, I know that there definitely were fights between Jackson and Dom, but more, I don't know, since when is it a tally race? Like, <laughs> there's obviously fights between- He's coming for Olivia's crown. The, the whole thing, all of us knew that there was tension between Olivia and Dom, not Jackson and Dom. So, what does he mean by that? I don't know. I oh, genuinely, I know there were fights and I know there was a couple, uh, you saw a little bit of it at their reunion when Jackson had a crack about Dom, mm-hmm. uh, to Dom about something. I, I totally forget what that was about. I genuinely, mm-hmm. I think I've wiped that whole dinner party out of my mind. <laughs> PTSD, hey. you're like- Genuinely, oh. I can't remember it. And I know there were a few more back and forths and there was more said from Jackson than was aired at those things to Dom. Mm-hmm. So, I know that when some of those altercations were occurring, there was definitely more input from Jackson towards Dom. But in terms of Jackson having more fights, I don't think so. Yeah. So, in terms of Jackson having more beef with Dom than Olivia, is no. that true? No, 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 no. So, no. he had beef with Dom, but not as much as Olivia and Dom. I don't know. I don't know. I don't know how much of a competition it is. I'll tell you right now, there wasn't- <laughs> Like, I, I'm not sitting stats. there tallying. I'm not sitting yeah. there tallying going 43%. Of it. I don't know. I don't. Who cares? At the end of the day, there was a um, very heated relationship between Olivia and Dom. And I know that Jackson and Dom had a few altercations as well. You may not have seen that on TV. And were those arguments that they had related to Olivia and Dom's arguments? Like, yeah, 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 yeah. So, it was where like, we go back and forth. Okay, so I interpreted how he said that as if, like, him and Dom were having like an argument about, I don't know, what colour the sky is or whatever it was. And then Dom- a weird thing to argue about on maths. And then Dom and Olivia were having their own arguments and that's how no, I was No, no, no. Like, it's all, it was all like as so one. it was just him defending Olivia and going into bat for Olivia and sticking yeah, up for her. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Or like having his own opinion on the scenario or something like that. Yeah, yeah. No, it definitely wasn't more. <laughs> no, a, yeah, I don't think there these, was more. We're getting, going, getting through all of these claims. Yeah, you're trying quickly. so hard. I just want to get to the bottom of it. So oh, it's yeah. It's to every story. Yeah. Now, Olivia also maintained that there was no harm or malice intended when she shared the nude photos of Dom around with the cast behind her back. I want to set the record straight on what I think this is all about. Whether you intend to do something bad or not is irrelevant. The action is relevant Mm -hmm. and what that represents. So, okay, she may view it as she didn't mean to bring Dom down, whether that's true or not. I will never know. I'll never know the truth behind that. How yeah, you ever know how? Know. So, yeah, only yeah. she will know. So that's all um, irrelevant. What is relevant though is the action that occurred, and how that hurt someone else, and how that was not the right thing to do. And this was the whole premise of what I tried to figure out on that dinner table, and what Dom was most hurt by. It's the fact that that is the wrong thing to do. Mm, well, like Dom Full said, stop. I don't care that the photo's out there. I care that it's. Been shared and talked correct, about. Correct, correct. So, regardless of whether you intended to do X, Y, or Z, recognize what has happened, what this has done to someone, and what it is, what that action has. I'm sorry, I said this on the show. This action physically uh, or just emotionally hurt someone else. Mm. That should be enough to realize that it's the wrong thing to do. I understand that I have done things in the past that have hurt people and so on and so forth, but I recognize those as mistakes and I learn from those. Oh, yeah, I'm not going into that anymore because to be totally honest with you, what we should do with that story is recognize that it happened and Dom's accepted it. It is what it is. We've got to move on. No. Can I just also say, because I still feel like, and Dom said this on Friday and I'm like, mm. I still feel like Olivia's not understanding, like, in terms of- It's not my place to make her understand. Well, in terms of the the law when it comes to distributing photos, so, like, I've seen this a lot in rugby league. If there is a photo- Do you date footy players? No, no. Everyone, Megan dates footy players. Definitely not. If there is a photo that's been circulated, it doesn't matter if you're the first person to share it or if you were the last person. If you share it at all under the law, you've done the wrong thing. There you go. So- I think what she's saying is that, you know, it was already out there. It was already on these platforms. That doesn't make it right. Like, it shouldn't be on those platforms or whatever, even if it is on those platforms. If you then share it onto whoever you share it onto, you're then culpable. 
Yeah, I so, guess so. And if, if I'm not a lawyer. So I don't know, but Olivia it's the wrong thing to do. If Olivia shared it, say she shared it, which I know she did, with to Jackson's work colleagues, no, no idea why or how that can't that, be intentional. Is that fact? Yeah, it's being investigated right now because one of the friends got in touch with me and told me that they saw the photos. Because, right. yeah, they said it wasn't just the cast that saw the photos. It was a, like, I work with Jackson. I've, I saw the photos. They got sent to me from Olivia. Mm-hmm. Do you, are you I obviously not been listening to So Dramatic? Come on. I told you, I don't <laughs> listen to anything. I'm done. I've done my still on the maps. I'm not getting involved with the drama again. Yet here I am sitting with you learning so very much. Well, how does that make you feel hearing that? Oh, it's pretty shocking. Allegedly, it wasn't just the cast who the photos well, were sent Obviously, there was to. the friends that helped to find them or she, they found them and sent them to whatever the hell, mm. whatever, whatever. So, obviously, they would have seen it. But what's it then? Jackson's friends. Jackson's workmates. And I was like, what, Jackson sent them? And they said, no, Olivia sent them to us, which is I'm like- That's God, a whole was, other ball game. She was tight with the work friends early. She was getting in there. But yeah, they saw them. Okay. Back to my point, though, what I'm trying to say is mm. if she sent them to those friends- yeah, why was she if saying they, it If more? they then sent them on to someone else, they are also culpable. So, I get a lot of people sending me nude stuff all the time. I'm like, please don't Do send now? Yes, because they're like, oh, my God, this person, you know, did- And I'm like, please don't send this to me. This is illegal. Like, you sending it to me is illegal. Yeah. Delete it from your phone. I'm deleting it. I'm not passing it on. If I was then to, sh- to share that with anyone, I would be culpable. So, okay. at any point of that chain, if you share that photo, you are- Part of the link, yeah. Part of the link. So, I don't think- It's not a valid thing to be like, well, it was- out there on this website or wherever the hell it was, wherever she got it from. No, I don't believe that in that either. she shared it on at all is still, you know. I agree. And that's just, what I'm saying by the action. I hope people understand that. Like, it doesn't matter where you got it from or who sent it to you. If you then forward that on to anyone, you have also committed got a good a example. Crime. Let's say, actually, see where this goes all the way back to. Have you watched the Pam and Tommy thing yet? No. You watch it. It's all about- I'm watching their- like six freaking shows at once. <laughs> the Voice, the <laughs> Married at First Sight, Survive. I'm still catching up on SAS Australia. Anyway. How does your head work? Anyways. But, you know, there was the whole thing about Pamela Anderson, her sex tape getting around, et cetera, et cetera. Mm-hmm. It got shared and that was the issue and it got out of control, blah, blah, blah. Obviously, that was stolen. So, it was slightly different. I guess the different scenario here is that it was already on the internet, on the interwebs before, you know, for where it was found. But what they got charged for was not the theft of stealing the video. The guy got charged for- Distribution. Distribution. Yes. That's yes. the action. That's and, that's, the act. and I think the laws have only changed within the last couple of years because- uh, Including social media where and social media is correct. There was a lot of people having someone's nudes and sharing- Revenge porn. Revenge porn, yep. sharing them, and people would pass them on, and it was this whole thing. So, they're like, anyone that passes an intimate photo of anyone else on yep. without their permission. So, if I had someone's permission- you know, if I got a photo and I said, do you care if I pass this on to Jack? Yeah, that's fine. Pass it on to Jack, then that's fine. But if I haven't asked the person who is in the photo, who the photo is of, if I can share it, then it's illegal. And I think that's what she's missing. And I'm like, just look up the bloody Crimes Act. Makes sense. So, no matter what- know. Yeah. It's just- Yeah. Now, Whatever. we went on a bit of a tangent there, but I just wanted to get that off my chest. It's been annoying me. Yep. So, she said that there was no harm or malice intended when she shared the photo- she wasn't trying to slut shame her and it was because she thought that it was against your contracts to have the platform. So, we were thinking- but the platform was down. Has production left this up on purpose? Is this entrapment? That was what they've said in this interview. So, yeah, what's your thoughts what do you mean? on that? They never said that on the show. It was what they've said after, their reasoning after. They were worried that Dom had broken her contract and they were also worried that producers were, you know, trying to entrap her with some storyline about her OnlyFans account. But she went and found it. <laughs> Yeah, can we can we set the record straight on that as well? Because a lot of people are still thinking producers put her up to this. No, the whole thing is that she let the producers know. She said that. God, there's so many, so many, so many. She, regardless, so she many let the producers know that, that she confused. has come into contact with this information. Right, yes, because she said it was against our contract. Yeah. Yes, you're right. So, she has come up with the information, whatever it is. Yes. If you really, 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 really liked this video, please click on the like button as well as the subscribe button so you can be notified of more videos like these.